morning guys happy friday we made it to another friday and it's the last friday of the term it's half term next week so no school for you next week get a nice long week off um so have a really good day your last day of doing school work and maybe we'll be able to start getting thinking about how we're going to get year five back to school next half term oh my gosh i'm so excited Friday. So, oh no, so I've just had a thought. Some of you were saying that you didn't have your mats in your pack today. And I am like a million percent sure that I put maths booklets in your pack. And now I'm looking and I can see that I don't think I have maths booklets. Hmm. This is very odd because I did ask Samuel to put them in. So I don't have one. You should have. Yours won't be in a booklet. Yours will just look like this. Because I couldn't um, fold it or staple. The photocopy wasn't working. But yours will look like this. And you'll eventually come to a page which looks like this. And it's arithmetic test 9 today. Now the problem with these arithmetic tests is... It's a nightmare. You're not going to be able to show your owner your answers. So what I would like you to do is work your way through your booklet. But in uh, in your actual book, your maths book, I would like you to... <coughs> Sorry, not your maths book, just one of your exercise books. I would like you to just write out the question and write your answers so it fits on one page. Such a waste of paper. So you could use these to play school at home or, you know whatever you want to do. You could use them on your brothers and sisters if you wanted to. Um, but don't worry about filling out. I mean, you can fill out the, the booklet if you want and then copy your answers up. Um, but you won't be able to show your Hona all your answers because there's so many pages. So look for your test. It should look like this in your pack. A couple of you said you haven't got it. If you haven't got it, it's on the website in the resources section. Um, so you'll have to work off the website, but you should have them. Samuel was in school and helped me put all these in your packs. And I remember, so they should be in there. Have a good look. They're at the end. In fact, I think they're at the very back of your, um, wallets. Can't remember. Have a look. Sorry guys, it's so much photocopying. Nightmare. <coughs> Excuse me. So that is your math today. You have half an hour to complete your arithmetic test. Um... If you don't finish in half an hour, you definitely need to be working a lot faster. Um, if you don't finish, you need to then get a different colour pen and carry on until you do finish in a different colour pen. So if you get up to page, up to question 17 by half after half an hour, um, I want you to go grab a pencil or a pen that's different and carry on until you finish. And if, and if, if you could write how long it does take you all together, that would be helpful. If it takes you 45 minutes... Um, again, that's far too long. You need to be working faster. But if it takes you 45 minutes, that's useful to know. So next week, we can try and beat that time. <coughs> um, and you can submit that to the dojo, please. Uh, for English today, we're doing our weekly reporting. You are going to tell me what's happened in your house this week. Um, anything exciting? Exciting things on the news as well this week. Um, what can you tell me has been happening on the news? I've been putting news around on the website on our class page every day so hopefully you're having a little look at that as well um i'm excited i love i love receiving your newspapers they're so nice i've got some excellent ones coming that you've done on the computer or on your tablets um but some lovely hand-drawn ones as well they're all really good i'm really impressed and um, for spag today um you've got spag mat looks like this we're moving to summer now because the autumn ones are too easy um have a go Make sure you read the questions carefully. Some of you do some random things. Uh, and then lastly, nice, easy uh, topic today. I want you to make me a food word search. So think about all the things we've been talking about this week. You could think about digestion. You could think about the eat well plates, the different nutritional information. You could talk about ingredients that you know. I want you to choose 20 words. 20 words is hard. 20 food words. You need to fill out this section first. So you might do like kale, uh, carbohydrate, da, 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 da. and then 
you've got a word search. Once you put your words in, you then start writing your words onto the grid. Do this in pencil because you might get to a point where you put 17 words on and you can't fit your last three words on anywhere. So you might need to do some rubbing out. You all know how word searches work. So I might write kale, K-A-L-E. Carbohydrate ends in an E, so I might write carbohydrate here. C-A-R-B-O-H-Y-D-R-A-T-E. I just realized I was writing that backwards. Um, but that's okay, you can do some words backwards on your word search. Um, and then once you've got all of your words on your word search, they don't all have to connect, you can do some that are on their own. Um, once you've done all your words, then write in loads of random letters in all the gaps. See if someone in your family can have a go at doing it. If you're finding that tricky, drop me a message on the Padlet and I'll do an extra video about how to how I would do it in a bit more detail. Um, I hope you all have a lovely, lovely half term. Uh, oh, before I say that, I hope you can join our quiz this afternoon. Um, I'm not sure who's doing it yet. <coughs> Made this video a couple of days early, so I'm not sure. Um, hopefully you can come though, 2 p.m. would be nice before the end of the half term to finish off. Um, I'm gonna be busy planning over half term what we are going to try to be doing after half term. I will keep you up to date um, with things going on. I'm going to make a half term Padlet for you to chit chat on, um, but there won't be any schoolwork for the next week. Um, and we've got one more work, uh, week of work in our packs so I'll make sure the new packs are ready for you to collect um, the first week back if we if we need them. Um, I, I think, I'm not really sure when year five will be going back to school yet. As I said, I made this uh, video a couple of days before Friday, so that could be different now, but um, we will see. I'll keep you up to date. Um, and if I get any information over the holidays, I will pop it on the Padlet so you guys know. I miss you all lots, cannot wait to hopefully see you all next half term at some point. Um, make sure you all keep safe, keep washing your hands, follow the rules guys. Don't be being silly and hanging out in huge, great big groups. You know what the, what the instructions are. If we follow the instructions, we'll get back to school sooner and we'll all be able to hang out together um, a lot quicker. Um, that's it, be nice, be kind, miss you all. Bye, happy holidays.